everybody, how you doing? Welcome to another episode of M Guns Beer Review. Thank you for coming by. I've got a beer here that I've tried several times. Um, organic Chocolate Stout. Pretty good beer. Um, I wanted to share it with you. Um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, M Guns Beer Review, please do. Hit the subscribe button, leave a comment, give me thumbs up, and, uh, you know, We'll uh, sit down and share a beer as we go through all these episodes. This episode is episode 10 beer review by M. Guns Beer Review. Um, actually, uh, 11. This is uh, 11? I think I said 10 or 11? I don't know. All right. Hey, again, welcome. Let's kick it off. Let's do a quick little review of what this beer is about. Again, um, looking at Beer Advocate. Let's go up here a little bit. Um, they rate this as a, their score they give it is a 95. Okay, a 95, it's an English stout, right number one. Um, and uh, Samuel Smith Old Brewery in Tadcaster, England, the United Kingdom. That's where this comes from. Uh, it's brewed, it's available year round. Um, I'll read you a few notes on it. Uh, brewed with well water, original well in 1758. It's still in use with the hard water is drawn from 85 feet underground. 85 feet this water comes from. Underground, the gently roasted organic chocolate malt and real organic cocoa used in this ale is delicious, smooth, with a creamy character, with inviting deep flavors and a delightful finish. This is the perfect marriage of satisfying stout and lux luxurious chocolate that will lead to smiles and refills. Samuel Smith's brew in traditional coppers uses stone Yorkshire squares for fermentation, fermentation and ships every bottle from the brewery with great pride. I love businesses like that, that put that extra oomph in it, you know, give it a special little twist of their own and uh, try to do the best they can to ship it all around the world so everybody is satisfied. Again, I've had this beer before. I've been satisfied. It's been quite some time, but we'll uh, pop the top here in a little bit and uh, I'll give you my true vote. All right, moving on down on Beer Advocate. Um, Again, a 95, not bad at all. A lot of people commented on it. Um, you know, they say it's great, uh, great tasting. Um, and, uh, you know, sweet chocolate flavor. Let's try it, all right? Uh, let's use this little handy dandy bottle opener my, uh, my uh, wife and kids got me for uh, Father's Day. Yeah, all right, let's go. Let's pop it. A little frosty. This is a nice pint size, so we got some in here. Not a lot of action out of the out of the bottle. Let's see what we got. Look at that creamy, soapy head. Carbonation is amazing. You probably got a uh, three finger, two and a half, well, about a two finger head. You can see a lot of that carbonation going on in there. Boy, I could smell that sweet roasted chocolates right now. All right, let's use the uh, sniffer and uh, let's see what kind of smells we get out of this here using our senses. Yep, dark roasted smell, sweet chocolates. A little mild coffee smell. I can smell a little mild coffee. Nutty, woody smell. A little gritty. A little gritty smell, kind of like uh, woody earth tones, kind of. little woody earth tones. Slight, very slight hop aroma. The head is going down a little bit. Carbonation is settled. Very good smell though, very good smell. It's good, all right, salute. Let's try the uh, the palate. Wow. If you like chocolate, cocoa, sweetness, bitters, this is the beer for you. I'm telling you what, no hoppy finish taste whatsoever. 
first part of it that you take in is the sweetness, the cocoa, the chocolate, the, the roasted um, like uh, barley, um, maybe the molasses and a little bit of coffee taste. And then it just goes smooth down. It's almost like drinking like a uh, like a, a root beer float. To be honest with you, I mean it's 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 a very good tasting beer. Very good. Ooh, it's five percent. It's five percent alcohol. Not a lot. Yeah, very rich, very rich. It's got a little bit of a head left, rich flavor, molasses, chocolatey, like I said, flavor still. Um, on that second pull, a little tiny bit of a bite on the back of the palate, very small. Nothing, uh, nothing to drive you, nothing to drive you crazy and cringe and do all that crazy stuff, but should be able to fit this in here. any extra sediment in there that's all she wrote very good color very dark um almost root beerish you know but don't get discouraged by the color like usually when you have those that, that darker beer you're kind of like oh man it's gonna have a real big bite again like i said very excuse me very smooth very smooth going in um nothing uh nothing crazy it's still got that soapy that soapy head oh man that last bit of pour right in there a lot of chocolate a lot of chocolate and i like chocolate it's good stuff salute again Real good, real good. Yeah, I uh, I enjoy it. I tell you what, let's get the rating this beer. You know they say it's organic, organic stout, all right? Organic chocolate stout, um, all their natural flavors. Um, again, you know, I, I, I enjoy it. I love the bottle itself. It's got some, uh, it's got Samuel, Samuel Smith on the side of the bottle right there. You can see it forged in there a little bit. Pretty good, man. Go get yourself one, all right? I guarantee you, you'll enjoy it. Um, again, I've seen this at a lot of places. So some of your bigger, um, you know, beer stores that carry a variety of different types of beer. Some of those stores where you can uh, make your own six pack and stuff with all the different types of uh, bottled beer they have. Uh, those types of places, beer distributor places are pretty good. You know, I, it's where you'll probably pick this thing up at. But hey, I like it. I like it a lot. Um, talks a little bit on the back of the back of the bottle about you know the brewery, this, that, and the other. Kind of like what I read you, but it's got a little bit more in there. But hey, let's rate it, okay? I've had a few pulls. I enjoy it. A very hearty beer. A beer that probably would uh, go good with uh, a steak. Okay, um, it has that sweetness to it. So, you know, anything pretty hearty, hamburger would be great with this beer. Um, could I have another? Yeah, I could. I could. I could probably have two because uh, I enjoy it so much. Now, if you've been to my channel before, I rate my beers on salutes. Okay, four being the best. I'd have to say this one right here would probably be a three. Okay. That's right, a three, three salutes, okay? I enjoy it, and I guarantee you, hey, go out and try it, and I guarantee you, you'll enjoy it as well. If you don't, oh well. Everybody's got a different palate. Everybody uses their senses a little bit different, so you may have a different uh, a taste. You may have a different smell to it. It's okay, all right? But enjoy yourselves. 
Have a beer whenever you can. Try some new beers whenever you can get that opportunity. And hopefully um, you can give me some suggestions in the comments when you subscribe, if you haven't already, to M Guns Beer Review. Give me a thumbs up. Um, leave me a comment. If there's something you're interested in, I'll go out and search for it and get it. Okay? Um, let's keep this uh, beer community going. Uh, I thank everybody for watching. I appreciate everybody out there. Uh, enjoy yourself and remember this. Do what's right when no one's looking. Thanks for coming by.